gets deep. It's gone. Kyle Schwarber with a leadoff blast. Well, that'll get the joint jumping. Huge series. Has had great luck at Wrigley, and that continues with a first pitch base hit. Game tied. Streaking around third is Riley. He'll slam on the brakes. It's 1 1. Ozzy Albies now with 18 career hits at Wrigley Field. Drives home his 43rd run, and that rundown pays dividends for the Braves. We're tied one apiece. Acuna's running, got a great jump, and a high fly ball wallop toward right field and deep. That ball is going to be at the base of the wall. Acuna's going to score. Dansby doubles him home, and the Braves are in front. Another day, that's deep into the bleachers or in the basket. But Dansby Swanson now with 49 RBIs, and Atlanta very happy to cash in the hit batsman. Wind, and you never get a break. High fly ball hit toward left. Schwarber drifting back. Warning track wall. It's gone. He hit it under radar. And Freddie Freeman now with 31 RBIs in June. He goes oppo. And the Braves have scored three times to take an even larger lead here in Chicago. Wow. And if you need any more reason why he's not the starting first baseman in the All Star game, there you go. Lifted toward right. That's going to be a tough play for Marcakis. He's sprinting, still coming, still coming. He can't get there, but Freddie did. Freddie Freeman reached up at the last moment and hauled that ball in. Freddie Freeman is a good 40 yards down the right field line. What a play by the Braves. Gold glove first baseman. Eight up, eight down for Wilson. Everything clicking for Atlanta today. The pitch. Swing and a base hit to center that scores one here comes Acuna they're waving him. Hayward loads up here comes his throw it's going to be cut off Dansby with a three RBI day. Braves cash in two more walks and the Boo Birds are out in Chicago it's six to one. That's a base hit two runs are going to score and it's a six to three ball game. It was and called strike three and cargo saying you can't give them both and now Joe Madden's going to come out and try to protect Carlos Gonzalez and he just got thrown out arguing balls and strikes now he fires the bat to the ground. Joe Madden tried to get there in time to save cargo but he got there too late and Gonzalez strikes out for the second time. Gets away. Hey. Six to four. Go ahead and take the walk and trust the next guy to do damage. Flared to left. Fair ball. And it's a one run game. It's a double for Rizzo. Six to five. Well, he has certainly been rewarded for making contact today, hasn't he? A little blooper to shallow left that should have been caught, dropped in for a single. Here he shanks one down the left field line and ends up with an RBI double. That ball lace. It's going to get to the wall. Rizzo scores to tie it. Hayward on his way to third. Save. A triple. This ball's hit high in the air to center. Almora going back. Look at him turn. That ball's going to leave the yard. 
You called it Jeff the ball is starting to fly even with the wind blowing in. And Ozzy Albies continues to terrorize Cubs pitching that is his 19th hit at Wrigley Field and the Braves have pulled to within one it's eight seven. They do add on. Nine to seven. An electric atmosphere here at Wrigley Field as 31 year old right hander Craig Kimbrell will make his Cubs debut. Career 1.91 earned run average. Oh man, the can is hot. He's got a point. And then you're gearing up for 98. It's hard to do anything with that backdoor curveball. He was trying to be real small with his approach, real quiet with the lower body. It fouled off that previous fastball. And up the middle, Russell there. Here we go. Ground ball to first. Kimbrell's got cover. Miss up. And the back cuts win. Oh man. Kimbrell said, "Thanks, big boy." Well, he Freeman, became a spectator. Yeah, Freeman crossed him up. Tried to pull that ball. Hit it pretty well down the line. Rizzo was positioned well and just wins that race to the bag. He looks up, sees Kimbrell's not going to be there in time, so the sprint is on. Yeah, Kimbrell just, you know, you can tell no matter how much experience, all-star, all the success, he was in the moment, and he completely forgot to cover first base. 